Hi, my name's Steve Papadopoulos. We're here at the 2018 MS Cinder de Gaulle bike ride. It's the 37th year. We've got 69 people with MS4 riding today with 10,000 people. I have MS. I was diagnosed three years yesterday, actually. Years ago, I used to do MS Readathon, and now I'm doing MS Wellness Run. Three, two, one. Have an amazing one. I rode the MS Gong Ride today, number one, to show that people with MS can actually take part and do it, and number two, to raise some money. I was diagnosed with MS in 1998. I was told I would never do this silly sports stuff again by the neurologist who diagnosed me. I love it when somebody tells me I can't do something, and exercise has been my savior. It's pretty amazing, but that hill, you take a ride with left turn and you hope for a downturn, but no, oh, there's, there's another down. downturn. <laughs> it just keeps going up. But yeah. this is a great, great reward for getting through that hill. Special mention to my friend Natalia who has MS. Uh, we do this ride for you and the uh, thousands of people that suffer from MS and fingers crossed we will find a cure in the future. Mate, Mary Perry from Canberra has MS. So, you know, an event like this is excellent. More should be done. It's one of those things where, you know, it's a challenge. But with a father with MS, we can see that every single day, just living is a challenge for him. Every time I get tired on the, on the race, I think, stop whinging, because I only have to deal with that for 90 kilometres, where he's got to deal with it every day of his life. Great job, guys. I'm so proud of you. We can come down here, enjoy a day in the sunshine on our bikes, raising funds, supporting those that are really working hard here, the volunteers. Then uh, you know, I play my little role and I can sort of you know, get a little bit of a tough smile as I go across the finish line over here. As of today, we've got 2.3 million raised to date and we're pretty confident that with the support of all of our participants, we'll get to that $3 million target so that we can continue to provide the services to the many clients who come to us each year in need of support.